Hello everybody! Well, let me introduce myself for you guys. For those who don't know me, my name is Ellen Correa and at the moment I'm living in, Dub in Dublin, in Ireland and first of all I want to say thanks for my friend Aline Munhoz who was the one who invited me to be recording this video for you. I'm here to start, to start a series of videos and I'll be giving you some tips about hospitality for you to know how to welcome your guests, right? Well, today I'll be teaching you how to make that bowl that you see with the bath towel in the beginning of the video, okay? But maybe you are asking yourself what bath towel has to do with being hosp hospitable? Or why should you give a bath towel for your guests if you are quite sure they will bring their own towel? Yeah, they may bring it, but let us say that they forgot it. So if you have prepared one, will be much better, don't you think? So they can even bring, let's say they, they bring it, but perhaps they come a long way and they they will be tired and the only thing they, they, they want, they wish, is just to take a shower and have some rest. And though they are tired, they will have to open the suitcase and find it and to, to, to search for it. Um, but if you already prepared the towel for them, you will be able to avoid all that tiring things. And they will be very happy and pleased for sure and you also will be satisfied will be pleased to know that you did well um, but of course it's it, it is not just to put the tower there and that's it no you can still use your creativity and make the room cause you're doing the bowl that I will show you right now okay so let's go bath towel okay um, if you you are receiving um, a couple then you put two bath towel and one face towel but if you are not receiving a couple you are just receiving a friend a single a single friend then there's no need to put two two bath towel okay so I'm using a red one but if you say oh, I don't have a red one, my my towers, my tower are all white or any color, so we can still doing right. So you place the tower upon the bed. Make sure it's in the middle of the bed. Then you place the other one, okay, like this, fold in the middle. I forgot to tell you. You just need to fold in the middle place like this on the bed, stretch it, okay, stretch like this, and once you stretch, you get in the middle, make sure it's in the middle, right, and then you put it together like this, put a bit pressure, right, once you did, you have done it, The, the, the tower face fold in the middle as well right like this and just roll up like this hide the tip of the, the, the face tower okay and you stretch a little bit make the waves right like this to look nice hide the, the label my label is just showing up I'll hide it this. You do the same with the other side. You stretch it a little bit, then make the waves as well. Hide the label again beside the knee. Okay, like this. I think. Okay, and make sure it's really in the middle of the bed okay because if it's not in the middle of the bed it 
won't look nice. I don't know if mine it is. I think so. So, there you go. It's really simple, really easy to do, but really makes the difference. Okay? Make make your your bag looks very nice. Okay? So, 